Hi friends, welcome or welcome back to Paychecks and Prayers. Here on our channel, you'll see some cash shelving videos of our expenses, some savings goals, and occasionally we'll do a cash condensing video and exchange our real bills for prop bills to then take back to the bank. Please stick around and join me on our video today. Hello my friends, how's it going for you today? I am filming a little bit back to back, so I do apologize if I don't have any new updates to give you from my previous video, but the only thing I can say is thank you guys so much for your constant love and support to my channel. It truly means the world to me, and without you guys, I wouldn't be, you know, holding myself accountable. Even though I am behind filming and all of these, I am getting to it. You know, I have been present in my life. My husband and I do have a nine to five job and yeah, our jobs are pretty demanding and sometimes we work a little bit overtime and sometimes we just want to sit back and relax, put our feet up and enjoy the evening together. So I am so sorry that I'm so behind in filming, but I'm also behind in cash stuffing, so we really needed to get it together. All right, so in today's cash stuffing, it will be the final paycheck for the month of April. In here, we should have $1,355. Let's give it a count. We have 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 550. 570, 90, 6, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 7, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 8, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 9, 10, 30, 50, 70, 90, 1010, 30, 50, 70, 90, 1110, 1130, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 200. So this is 1200. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 300. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55. 1,355 is here and accounted for. So let's go ahead and get started with my wallet binder. And we will just kick it off from the top. I won't have any dollar bills because like I mentioned, I am pretty behind in cash stuffing, so there shouldn't be any dollar bills. Going into our $1 bill savings challenge, I will be giving myself $20 for eating out. And now I have 40 in there. And to be so behind, you guys, I am pretty proud of myself that I have not had the urge to swipe my card. So I've just been holding off and eating out, eating, you know, taking home for lunch. Sorry, taking what I have from my house to uh as lunch to my job jesus i can't form sentences so i added 15 out of gas it has 100 dollars and i've been doing pretty good with gas even though my tank is pretty big groceries will be getting 80 dollars in this one 20 40 60 80 so we currently have in this grocery envelope 20 40 60 80 1 20 40 65 70 so 170 for groceries. Hair is gonna be getting at $50, and I think this will complete it. I will be going to get my hair done next week. I am filming this in May. Today is May 4th, so may the 4th be with you. <laughs> so we currently have one, two, three hundred, four hundred dollars for my hair. And I'll be getting it done, not next week, I'm sorry, the following week before I leave for Canada. My nails currently has $150. So we'll skip that one. Spending will be getting 50. And it currently has 200 in spending. My miscellaneous envelope will be getting five. So that will put it at $15. And let's go ahead and move on to my husband's wallet binder. In his wallet binder, we will kick it off with his Snackies envelope. I love this envelope and apparently so do you guys. You've mentioned it so that it's so funny that he labeled it Snackies and I let him choose whatever he wanted to write on these envelopes. So <laughs> anyways, for his eating out, he has $40 as well. 
this groceries envelope is for him in just in case he needs to stop at the grocery store i'm the one who normally does the bulk of the groceries but just in case he needs to stop by and get something i put a little something in here for him so we added 20 he is up to 60. and his haircuts will be getting skipped but he has 35 in there spending will be getting 50 and that puts him at 150 for his spending envelope and the flowers envelope will be getting ten dollars it currently has 10 20 30 40 dollars and this is for him to buy me flowers he specially requested this envelope to be in his binder super sweet the miscellaneous envelope in his wallet will also be getting five dollars and that will put him at ten for his i don't know why i wrote five i have 15 in my and he has 10. all right let's go ahead and move on to our high priority in the high priority binder we will be kicking it off with annual fees as normal and it will be getting at fifty dollars as usual as well and that puts annual fees at five six hundred seven hundred eight hundred and forty so eight hundred and forty for annual fees and i believe i can cap this one at around a thousand so we will see annual pass will be getting fifty dollars and this is for uh, the renewal of our universal studios annual pass it has five six seven hundred in our savings eight hundred nine hundred dollars total is that correct? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yes, nine hundred. Subscriptions will be getting twenty-five, and it's ending the month with twenty, forty, sixty, eighty, one hundred, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. One hundred and twenty-four subscriptions. Association will be getting forty. And it currently has 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 20, 40, 60, 70. So 170 for association. Car insurance will be getting 55. Oops, these got stuck together. All right, so we have five, six, 700 in our savings, 800, 900, 950, 70. So 980, 85, 90, 95, and this is, oh boy, I lost count. I think this is a thousand. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine fifty, nine seventy, nine eighty, nine eighty five, nine ninety, nine ninety five. Yeah, one thousand. One thousand dollars in car insurance. Car maintenance has $1,000, and that one is capped there. Car registration will be getting at 10, and it currently has 100, 10, 20, 30, 40. So 140 for car registration, and this is for both of our vehicles. Costco will be getting a 25 this week, and we now have 20, 45, 50 for Costco. We probably don't need to go anytime soon because we are heading out to Canada for 10 days. So I don't think we need much. 25 for household and it currently has 20, 45, 55, 60. So 60 for household. Toiletries will be getting 10 and it now has 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. Twenty will be going into the medical envelope, and it currently has one two thousand two hundred twenty forty sixty seventy. So two thousand two hundred and seventy. Dental has one thousand dollars, and that is capped for now. Vision will be getting five, and it has one hundred fifty five sixty five seventy. Riley will be getting $25. And that is our little doggy, little Mr. Riley. 
He now has 1, 2, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 95. So this is four hundred and ten dollars. He has four hundred and ten. Month ahead, we'll be getting twenty five, and it currently has one, two, three thousand, three hundred twenty, forty, sixty, eighty five, ninety five. So this is. 3,400, yes, 3,400 for month ahead. We still got a ways to go. Just in case has a thousand. And our buffer will be getting $5. And it has 10, 15, 25, 30. So 30 for this buffer envelope for this binder. And that does that for our high priority binder. Let's go on to our low priority. All right, so in our low priority, we always kick it off with manifest. And in here, it will be getting $25. Okay, so now manifest has 1,000, 1, 2, 300, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95, 400. So $1,400 in manifest. Anniversary will be getting 25 as well. And that puts anniversary at one. So one, 200, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95, 300, 300 for anniversary. And this is one of the ones that I'll probably be taking back to the bank since it's already at 300. Beauty will be getting $5. And it has 20, 40, 55, 65, 70. 70 for beauty. Cheers will be getting $5. And it has 5, 10, 15, 25. So $25 so far in cheers. Clothing will be getting $40. And it has 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 30, 40, 45. So 145. Date night will be getting 10. And it so far has 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. $90 for date night. Gardening will also be getting 10. And it currently has 50, 60, 70, 80, 95. 95 for gardening. And we need to replace some of the annual flowers up front because it's already summertime. And yeah, some of those are just not for the summer season. Gifts will be getting 25 and this will help us for a baby shower gift that we purchased. And I will show you that in my unstuffing video but um, this will also help us out for the wedding that we're going to in Canada for May as a gift to the couple. So gift has 100, 20, 40, 60, 80. So 200, 25, 35, 40. So 240 so far in gifts. Going out, we'll be getting $5 and it has one, 200, 5, 10, 15, 20. So 220 for going out. Home decor will be getting at $25. And home decor has 300, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95. So $400 so far for home decor. Had to adjust myself there real quick. Hosting will be getting 25. And it currently has 100, 20, 40, 60, 80. So 200, 5, 10, 15, 25. So 225 for hosting. Splurge will be getting $5. And that puts splurge at 
200, 20, 40, 60, 70, 85, 95, 305 dollars for splurge. Technology will be getting five dollars and it currently has 100, 20, 40, 60, 70, 85, 95, 205 dollars for technology. And lastly, our buffer envelope will be getting skipped, but it has $40 for this binder. And that does that for our low priority binder. Going into the birthdays binder, let's go ahead and finish off the May tracker here. So this is all for the uh, May birthdays that we may celebrate. And we are adding the final $50 needed to complete this tracker. And that should put us at $200 for the May envelope. We have 51, 50, 200, perfect. So now this is accessible for us for any birthdays that may be in May and we can just pull from there. Going all the way to the back for our parents, we'll be giving them $5 each. And my mom currently has 100, 20, 35, 45, 55, 65, 70. So 170 for her birthday coming up in July. My dad's birthday's in August. And he currently has 100, 25, 35, 45, 55, 60. 160 for him. The US envelope is for my husband and I, and we have 50, 70, 80, 90, 100, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 160 for our birthday so far, and really this is for our birthday, and our birthday's in December, so we've got a long ways to go. My father-in-law is also in December. He has 20, 45, 55, 65, 75, 80. And my mother-in-law should have the same. 20, 45, 55, 65, 75, 80. 80 dollars for her birthday. She's also in December. A lot of December birthdays. Alrighty, and that does that for the birthdays binder. And going into the vacation binder, we are going to Canada and we are still working on lodging. 75 will be going in this one. And that puts us at 1,100, 200, 300, 350, 70, 90, 410, 435, 440, 445, 450. So 1,450 for lodging. And I'm sorry, I forgot to mention in my last cash stuffing, but airfare is at a thousand and we are capping that so far for that. Excursions or AKA activities that we will be doing in, in Canada. We have one, two, 300 in our savings, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95, $400 total. Food and drinks will be getting 50. And we so far have one, two, 300, 400, $500 in food. Okay. Transportation will be getting $50. And it currently has one, two, 300, 400, $500 total. And this should cover what we purchased uh, we purchased a car while we're out there for Canada for the 10 days and yeah so hopefully that would be what would cover it so for souvenirs I set aside $300 that's in our savings and then spending will be getting an extra 25 and that puts our spending category at 1, 200, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95, 300 total for spending. And next month I think we'll be amping this one up too. So, is that 300? Yes. 
I believe so. Or was that? Yeah, three hundred dollars. Tips has two hundred dollars saved already. My handwriting is terrible. Spa will be getting its final twenty-five dollars, and this is for beauty while I'm out there, and it's basically for the wedding we will be attending. So we have 100, 150, 70, 90, 210, 230, 235, 40, 45, 50. So 250 saved for the beauty. And our miscellaneous is fully funded at $100 and that completes our vacation binder. All right, lastly we have a very unique binder. It's our boat binder and I'm pretty sure there's not a lot of cash surfers that I know out there that may have this binder. But basically, we purchased a boat that we do still owe a loan on, and that is the number one debt that we are working on aside from our house in the future. And yeah, currently we are just contributing a lot towards the principal so that we can quickly pay that off. And we're doing pretty, pretty good. So if you guys haven't seen my savings challenges, I will go ahead and link the latest one up here for you guys in the eye in the sky. And yeah, go ahead and check it out. I am adding all of my extra money into savings challenges and once I complete it, I put it towards the principle of our boat. So exciting, right? So we are adding $25 for repair and maintenance because the boat really needs it at least once a year. So it has five, six, seven, eight hundred dollars 20, 40, 60, 85, 95, so we are up to $900 already for repair and maintenance. Registration needs $10 this week. So we have 100, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90. So we are now up to $200 for the registration. Perfect. Equipment will be getting at 25 this week and that will put the boat equipment up to 500, 20, 40, 60, 85, 95. So it's just six hundred dollars total for equipment. Lastly will be the gas, boat gas category. It's getting $25. And currently it has one, two, three hundred, four hundred, twenty, forty, sixty, five, seventy-five. So 475 total for gas. And we do have to do an unstuffing for this one. So don't miss out on that. I will be filming that pretty soon and posting it here to you guys so you guys can see what I do with all of this money once we spent it. All right, you guys, I wanna thank you so, so much for sticking around to the very end. If you did, please leave me any heart color emoji that you would like down in the comments below to show your support to my channel and to let me know that you did make it this far into the video. Please go ahead and also give this video a huge thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Subscribe if you haven't already and remember to hit the notification bell so that you never miss out on any of my future videos. And with that being said, my friends, thank you guys again for sticking to the very end and I will catch you guys in my next video. God bless. Mm -hmm.